show you this. Here we go. For a day or two. For a least. day or two. 70 <laughs> degrees, the high today, 48 the morning low. Oh, they're not too far away. A little, both a little bit above normal. The normals are 67 or 47. The records are made. We've been as warm as 93, as cold as 11 back in 1948. Outside right now, it's 69. We have a south, southwest wind at 15. It's pollen. Well, actually, all year long is pollen season in North Texas, but it's spring pollen season. We have juniper, we have oak, both are high, hackberries moderate, and fungus today, that is low. Uh, mostly clear skies out there right now. Little disturbance rolled through this morning. That brought with it a couple scattered showers across the area. That has moved into East Texas tonight. Nothing more than a passing cloud. There's seven in the morning tomorrow. We'll have partly sunny sky, a little bit of cloud cover tomorrow, then partly to mostly sunny skies tomorrow afternoon. Here's Wednesday, Wednesday morning. Start with some clouds, some sun comes out as the afternoon moves along, and so it's dry. I have no rain in my forecast tonight, tomorrow, or on Wednesday. Thursday, we start with clouds. Watch this. Rain develops. Rain develops as the day moves along on Thursday. Thursday, the, the, the pattern right now is setting up kind of similar to what we had last Thursday. Now, last Thursday, we had severe weather potential. We had the severe weather potential last Thursday is the same as this Thursday. Quarter size hail and 60 mile an hour winds. We had zero of that, but we had one to three inches of rain across the area last Thursday when we transitioned from a hail threat, a wind threat into just a heavy rain threat. We have to wait and see as to whether or not that will happen. But at a minimum, another widespread soaking rain on Thursday. There's 7 p.m. Thursday. Cold fronts on top of us about midnight Thursday night. Cold front moves through, but the rain doesn't come to an end. I even have a scattering of rain in my forecast on Friday and even a little bit of rain in my forecast on Saturday. But for this Thursday, this Thursday, it's almost the same exact area and almost the same severe weather threat. Quarter size hail, 58 mile an hour winds are stronger. The tornado threat's not zero, but as of this moment, it's really, really really, really low. We'll refine this forecast and keep you updated. Otherwise, rainfall, another widespread soaker, half an inch to an inch and a half, higher amounts. Some places in East Texas could see three inches and west of Fort Worth, not much, but something, a tenth, maybe up to a half an inch of rain in the forecast then. Temperatures above normal until the cold front passes through late Thursday night and then cooler than normal Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Tonight, dry, breezy, not as cool. 54 is a low tonight. During the day tomorrow, it's a dry day, a breezy, warmer day. We hit 76 tomorrow. The next 14, there it is, 82 on Wednesday. A Mavs game tonight, a Mavs game tomorrow night. Scattered uh, rain, widespread rain Thursday, scattered rain Friday and Saturday, dry Sunday at St. Patrick's Day, and then the final seven of the 14 days, another chance of rain the end of next week and the following week.